Hi guys, this is Dr. Brian Alf from Alf Family Chiropractic right here in St. Francis. And did you know that over 850,000 chemicals are in use on any given day in the United States? Over 3 billion tons of pesticides are being sprayed each year on our crops. Find out in this video what this actually does to your body. The average person takes about five medications each day to help with some kind of issue that they have going on in your body. So with the chemicals we're coming into contact with, the pesticides that we're eating off our food and in our environment, this all has to be cleaned up by our liver, our main detoxification organ. So about 75% of that process occurs in your liver. The other 25% occurs in your gut. So if you have a bad gut, we also have an issue with detoxification. So often we have our patients go in and get some lab work done so that we can see what all these chemicals are actually doing to them. But some of the signs and symptoms are acne, pretty common, right? Uh, eczema, so your body is trying to detox through its largest organ through your skin. You get muscle aches and pains, just achy joints all the time. Fibromyalgia, chronic fatigue, so your energy levels are really, really low and creating pain. Uh, autoimmune disease, all are linked to toxic environments that we're in. So some of the tests that we often look at on a blood work would be AST, which is more having to do with the muscles uh, when we look at the liver enzymes, ALT, which is more indicative of what's going on with your liver, and we also look at something called GGT. So that usually is the big marker that a lot of people get missed on lab tests. So what that is actually is when your body uses something called glutathione in your body, it it produces something called GGT, and that has to go back to your liver to be made back into that compound called glutathione. So if you have too much GGT running around in your system, we know that you're not producing glutathione in the liver, so your liver is not producing the way it should. So what do we need to do then? Well, I've talked about this many times, we need to clean up the environment that we're around in. So what is the water you're drinking? Are you filtering it? Do you have a whole house filtration system? Are you eating foods that are organic, right? Staying away from as much pesticides as possible. So following that dirty dozen from the environmental working group and eating the clean 15 as well. So those are the things that we wanna look at. Hair and skincare products, a huge thing for chemicals, right? So lastly, in order to clean up the inside environment, we wanna give the liver some love, right? So we do a full detoxification program. Now this isn't a cleanse, so a cleanse is when we usually take something to, to get cleaning out your colon, right? This is a detoxification program that we like to use with our patients. So full medical food that will go down from phase one when everything comes into your liver down to phase three when it goes out the kidney when it's safely to be excreted through the urine. Uh, sometimes we need to add a little bit of gut health as well with that too to help clear and move some of that, especially if you're constipated, to clear a lot of that toxins as well. So, so if you're looking to clean up your environment on the inside as well as on the outside, definitely give our office a call. We can get you set on the path to feeling better overall. This is Dr. Brian Opp from Opp Family Chiropractic. Hope you enjoyed this video.